So what you do is you right click um, and go to new or you can go to track and go to new, right? And once this comes up, you go to mono stereo and then you go to um, instrument track, okay? And you create that and then there's your instrument track there. So you get that up on the board, okay? You get that up on your mixing board, which is over here. And you can find your mixing board uh, instrument track here. We go to inserts. And then we go to uh, multi-channel channel plugins. We go to instrument and we find our VSTs here. Okay, contact, load up contact. There we go, all right. Um, and then if we just load up any sound, um, trap layer. And we switch it to Omni. You can leave it on channel one, but I leave it on Omni, Omni uh, as well. The biggest problem I found was that even though I've done all this, there was still no sound coming out, even when I'm tapping the keyboard. So I found what you have to do is you have to go back to here and you have to turn on the recording strip to enable it. And then you get the sound. Yeah. Then you get the sound. Yeah. So once you've done that, and that's literally, and from there, you can start building out your track. Um... And you play it back. Yeah, and that's literally it. Dead simple. You're in. Start building out the tracks. So hope that helps how to load a VST or contact into Pro Tools 11, 12, whatever number it may be. Um, hope that helps, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.